Good morning and welcome in. I am the Canadian trucker Rudy and I am here with Diego. I'm Trucker's Rudy's son. Well, thank you guys for joining my channel and stay tuned for the rest of my day. Welcome to my day. I got uh, a little bit of traffic going on here in Toronto today. I've been driving for about an hour and 10 minutes and uh, we did a whopping 13 miles right now or not even quite 13 miles. So you guys can probably see we got pretty heavy traffic here today and I'm bobtailing over to uh, somewhere west of Ottawa to go rescue a uh, a trailer up there somebody got shut down apparently and uh, we got the old mighty jukebox on the other line there so so we uh, we're talking to him <laughs> anything special anything special you want to want the viewers to know jukebox today no they can't hear you but i can uh, i can uh, repeat that guys jukebox says uh, that he hopes that everybody is uh, is having a good day and then hopefully everybody is, is passing the vehicle uh, inspections out there so yeah I uh, I am actually going to pick up a trailer like I just said there a minute ago and the guy apparently got shut down at the scale so that's why I said I'm going to rescue a uh, a, a trailer or, or going to go deliver his load and apparently he got shut down for 72 hours so anyways we'll be back hey guys we are on the back roads now middle of nowhere pretty much i went on to uh, highway 7 basically it takes me across instead of going all the way that way up to ottawa and then come back this way so i'm taking a shortcut here but you got actually pretty slow speed up here it's only 80 kilometers an hour speed limit up here which is uh 50 miles an hour it's a little bit low but yeah well that's what you get when you get back roads i guess <laughs> oh well i'm really hoping i can uh, have something interesting for today yet but so far that hasn't happened yet but yeah, I've been pretty laid back today. I didn't get a load there until you know all the way this afternoon. So you know my buddy was up there too, so I spent uh, spending time with him, and we didn't do any videotaping. So now I got to try and catch up to at least have something for you guys. Looks like a little bit swampy area up here, eh? Yeah. Oh well there's another truck coming down this road too actually too <laughs> well this one looks like a local truck now oh, this one had an LED light bar on the bottom there they're usually pretty bright yep anyways I even tried to call the guy that uh, I'm supposed to pick the trailer up from and uh, haven't been able to get a hold of him but I'm sure he's up there somewhere but I'm hoping that I can find him, you know, especially when it's dark because uh, I didn't really get a hundred percent of a location exactly where he's at, but uh, They gave me his phone number, but like I said, he's not answering. I left him a message and he ain't returning my call, so I don't know We'll see We'll see I guess I was, uh, I was thinking earlier and I don't remember there being a scale up there, but you never know, right? Maybe it's just a pullover area and they have the DOT sitting in there, so we'll find out, I guess. Alrighty, guys, we are at a truck step along uh, Highway 17. 
and uh, I saw these uh, 102 inch pipes up here or uh, antennas I meant to say and uh, we went and uh, switched our uh, trailer with the guy that had a DOT violation and uh, now we're just walking around in the truck stop and looking at all the cool gadgets up here yes yeah, so as I said we picked up our trailer and uh, went over here and uh, scaled her made sure she's good and uh, yeah, look at some of these cool gadgets that we get up here eh? oh yeah yeah we we are certainly legal so we don't have to worry about that so we'll go to bed here pretty soon and then uh, continue on with our journey tomorrow eh? yeah look at this rooster up here that's what Jukebox was saying the other day to me. He's like a drooster. Anyways, we'll get out of here and uh, we'll be back. Alrighty guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that little tour there inside the truck stop. And uh, hey, we are back in the truck and we are ready for bed. Oh yeah. We definitely need to go to bed right now. But before we did, or before we do... I had to edit up a video. Just kind of figure I show you guys a little bit what I'm using right now. That's a program I'm using right now. That's the format that I'm using right now. Hope you're going to be able to see it. There's the date actually on there as well. Which video I'm working on right now. Yeah, so that's what we got to do at the end of the day, you know. I have to put these videos together for you guys otherwise you have absolutely nothing to watch and I figured I make sure I do this here right now and the reason being is uh, they actually have free Wi-Fi up here at this little truck stop here so uh, I had one rendered and that one is uploading right now but this one was just a shorter clip that I did to Columbus Ohio there on Sunday night and so it wasn't a very long clip because I didn't do anything during the day so it was just a more of a shorter clip so I figured I'd quickly put that together and render it because it probably wouldn't take extremely long so and then I'm gonna click on it to upload to uh, YouTube so that way it's on there ready for you guys so that way I don't have to use my uh, cell phone's uh, internet to uh, upload it but today is the same thing you know it's a bit of a weird day and a strange day a bit of a late start again in the afternoon so we didn't do a whole lot of videoing either today so figured i show you a little bit on what we do at the end of the day when we are ready for bed so but enough of that so we are signing out and we hope to see you again on the next one so give it a thumbs up share the video and be sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And we would uh, welcome you very much so. We enjoy having you on board. So we will see you again on the next one. Bye.